I was waiting for Trish to start jerking off, but he quit. Why is it non-contact? That's the way the game was set, so I just left it there. Okay. Oh, it's gonna be like a Jim Connor map. I'm uh. Yeah, that's probably true. We've done Boost. this race before. Boost. Yeah, we left it on contact for the first time. Now I remember. This was back when I still had my Sultan. Well, there goes Tech Rocks into the fucking trailer. What are you talking about? Holy shitty curses. Right behind you, John. Come on, take the corner. Ah, ah. Holy crap, this thing corners like a waffle. I noticed. Everybody do the flop. There's my high performance Subaru. It goes straight real fast, but it can't turn where to shit. All wheel drive! Why would where's they put my, a cinematic camera the there? I need one of those. I use the guardrail to turn. I got found it funny because uh, <laughs> yeah. the whole reason why my buddy bought his Lancer Rally Arc was because of that one Top Gear episode with the Evo in it. And then he goes and buys the model underneath because it's cheaper. I don't blame him. Oh, I'm not gonna blame him either, but my god. Actually, supposedly, all you gotta do is swap the turbo on the rally arcs and it's the same engine. Thing is, is you can only go 50 kilometers an hour in town, 40 kilometers in residential, so why do you need all that power? You really don't. Unless you plan on going to the track that doesn't exist anymore, unless they're bringing it back this summer. It's pointless. I don't think they are. I don't know, I heard all so many different law. stories about that track. About why it no longer exists. Some people were saying it was money. Some people were saying it was corruption from the staff. Some people were saying that there was an insurance liability. I don't know why they shut it down. Ours, the airport just didn't want to renew the contract. So we're like, fuck. Don't work. It wasn't in the airport. It was in Bombfield. Yeah. Uh, our, our place. Oh, your place, yeah. In Saskatchewan. That's good. Because they did that a few times too. They opened up one of the runways here for a drag race. Yeah, and they did uh, the the eighth mile, like the King of the Hill weekend. Yeah. I went the one weekend. It was pretty cool. My favorite track in North Bay or North Bay in Ontario still is uh, Sparta in St. Thomas. Yeah. I had a I lot of fun going to those tracks. My, my fucking buddy's fucking Mustang and souping that up, but I don't want to drive a modified car on the fucking 401 all the way to fucking shit Thomas. <laughs> That's what car trailers are for. Oh no, no. If I were to do it, I'd have the rope kill it. That's the only way to do it. <laughs> I saw the way uh, Grand Ben's track is. Grand Ben looks like a blast too. Like uh, Crazy British Bloke goes there all the time. Yeah, that place is pretty good. And, That's uh, where I tried to get past uh, El Camino in the parking lot and I like jumped over the back and landed on a waterbed. Oh. <laughs> oh. The guy put Thank a water bed at the back of his El Camino for more traction. <laughs> yeah, it's like, what the fuck? I haven't seen one of these in years. I don't know, Sparta's a nice track. Good, uh, good one, uh, one quarter mile track. Really dark, you like completely missed the finish. Canadian yep. Air Motorsports Park. <clears throat> And then Brian yeah, you came up to a big turn. Oh god. Oh, uh, did you take your bag, yo? <laughs> yeah, he really doesn't want to win. I'd I decided if he to does try win. out my carbon RS to see how this goes. Oh, are you serious right now? <laughs> I should have faggioed up. <laughs> Bye guys. Oh, oh god. Whee! Uh oh! Uh oh. <laughs> oh shit. All of a sudden, Ow, I just uh -oh. died. <laughs> I'm beaten. I'm not. I was about to say I'm being beaten by Tech Rocks, but. No. No, Tech won't ever let that happen. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Flame <laughs> tree! <laughs> Killer Dragon's on a goddamn cruiser. I almost got taken out by a Wreckham tree. I'm on a Carbon RS. So am I. I'm on my batty. I don't I'm know how much I'm to I, I imagine since it's got a higher post it top speed, it'll hit it. Oh! Holy crap. That looked painful. Who ate a shipping container? <laughs> I ate a car. Oh. Was it tasty? It tasted like petrol and death. Oh god. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Damn it, I just ate another car. 
I seen that, Mikey. You okay, buddy? Was a good second man. He broke his ass penis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate it when my rectal pector gets broken. That was such Why a troll video. That was funny. I was wondering where he went. I got it. Base. Who fucking hit me and didn't fucking die? Oh, hi, Don. <laughs> hey, buddy. <laughs> I've got the bag I'm going at actually a pretty good clue. I went for a swim. Dang! Wait. I came onto the beach and somebody fucking hit me. Hi. <laughs> That's one oh, thing I like about gosh. motorbike races is when you pull back it deletes ketchup. Gee. No more rust there. Oh, the bag is so <laughs> <laughs> Look at him catwalking that thing. The only thing saving him is his license plate. All of a sudden, that snaps off in here. Oh no! Just drag him. He's making sparks. Sparks, but he's running out of plate room. Yep. He can't even read the fucking thing anymore. Highway safety's gonna pull him over. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, never mind. Drinking a lot of water, so I'm not having over in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do that right after the beer. I did that last weekend, and I puked. I gotta get up at 7.30. Ouch. No what the fuck food. do you have to do on a Sunday, bud? Uh, biker you breakfast. You have to go to church. Fucking biker church. breakfast. Ew. Oh that sounds God, like church. I might ride my bike tomorrow. It's still plus four outside. I'm lucky. I wish it was plus four here. It's like friggin' minus eight. Apparently I missed the fucking checkpoint. Apparently a lot of people missed the checkpoint because I'm in second place. I'm third. I'm fourth. I'm in first. So whoever's in front of me, you missed it. Mikey. Yeah, I did. He's just rolling with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, because he can still get it. Yeah, where well, you're gonna be a lap down. Yup. No, I'm, I'm in fifth place right now. Oh. Shit. I'm in last place right now. <laughs> you beat my shady shiv. Oh, that's I'm a fruit stand. <laughs> Who puts a fruit stand on a berm? Fruit people? Make, make that fifth. I mean, how did I drop from second to third? I don't know, I'm about to say fucking go to the beach. I missed a checkpoint. And I was lapped. What? Why who? Yeah, I'm confused. I just got lapped by stuffage. I went from second to third to, to being lapped. I'm in fifth place, this is cool. Don't know how that happened, but fuck, I won't complain. <laughs> Yeah, I'm in fourth. So am I. Had too many beers. I'm in sixth now. I'm in I'm third in now. This game's what? broken. This I'm fucking race is busted <laughs> so hard. Like, <laughs> I just came in fourth place. Fucking Mikey was like, I'm in fourth. I'm like, I'm in fourth too. <laughs> like, fucking broken <laughs> ass piece of shit race. <laughs> yeah. Mikey was in third. Oh I yeah, I finished third. Fucking but broken me ass and Adam game. We're in fourth at the same time there for a minute. Wow. Always counting on Shady Shift and his fucking electric razor to come in sixth. Turbo. turbo. turbo yeah. Engine. It's got a turbo, right? So what I did was I just put another battery in it. <laughs> Are they running in series or parallel? You know what's really anticlimactic about an electric car? Pretty much everything. Oh, I did boost. Hey! <laughs> I forgot to boost, sorry. No, you pushed me off the track. Oh, <laughs> oh lady, somebody's One at a time. time. It was Mikey. No, people need to learn how to break. Oh! Oh, Mikey breaks right in front of me, gun. Where am I going? <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the windmills! Oh. Holy shit! I don't Church know what happened can. there, but that was awesome. Church is a can. 
Mikey, I wasn't gonna spin you out for the record. That was me. Yep, Trich is kinda, you just kinda <laughs> ran into me. I'm like, okay, is this how we're gonna do this? I'm not Mikey. Oh, was it not Mikey? I thought it was next to Mikey. Yeah, because flipping off is gonna help, you know, shoot somebody. Yep. Everybody's throwing sticky bombs. DK is flipping them off. Fuck you! Worse than 99% <laughs> <laughs> of the time at the time. Yep. Yeah. Okay, Mikey, you can go ahead and spin me out for the record. Yeah, that was me. Yep. Everybody's throwing sticky bombs. DK is flipping them off. Fuck you! Worse than 99% of the time at the time. Yep. Jesus. I got exploded. I got scared. Ow. That was kind of cool. Sorry for exploding you, buddy. Not really, but kind of sorry. Okay, I know you gotta win. Well, I don't gotta win, but I just don't want to come in last place because I'm, I'm driving like one of the slowest supercars ever made, and that's including the Sultan RS. One stock. Do you have a yeah, but a, a, a stock Zenturno will still beat a fully built Voltic. We've tested this theory. Yeah, my stock Zenturno beat everybody because I'm badass like that. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> Nice helping, buddy. Hi, Nick. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Bye, buddy. Me off the <laughs> I went to go inspect my car. My car sounds like a vacuum right now. Oh yeah, oh, me too. It's it's screaming it's so loud. Ah, oh, the salt went for the win. Yay! Yeah, it didn't come in last place for. Came a in second time. place with a with a vacuum cleaner. Yay! Word. Clean the vacuum. Oh, Manderville's here. Well, What's up, I Manderville? managed to get fifth place, and I hit the fucking. Uh, what up, Manderville? You dirty squirrel. <laughs> so, so in the middle of that race, I had to click back into Grand Theft Auto. Why you need to work on that, buddy? I didn't. I couldn't get a bike. It don't work. Wait, how did you guys get bikes but it wouldn't let me get one? Because you touched yourself. Off road, it don't them. work. Because they own them. I need to buy me a bike. Oh, Mikey. <laughs> fuck, 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 let me get out of the way. <laughs> yeah. Well, officially last place. Ow. Yeah, all right. My blood. Spine. Ah, yeah. It'll grow back. <laughs> Do some duct tape. Patch it up. So friggin' uh, tried some War Thunder again on PC earlier today. Oh yeah, I, yeah. I seen you playing that. It's. I. I don't mind it on PC. I actually like it better than PS4. Now stairs. Do you notice how maps load a lot quicker on PC? Yeah. That's because more people play it on PC. So, with my 360, would I be able to play it on movie settings, or would I lag out too bad? I don't know, give it a try. If it sucks, turn it back. I don't have your card, dude. I can't tell you how well it performs. Yeah. I'm gonna you have downloaded to... that shit to monitor all your temps and stuff, too, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I let mine go until the computer just shuts off. <laughs> well, that's the thing, is the computer does have safeties in place that if things get too hot, it's not going to catch fire, it's going to shut, yeah. it's going to kill the power. And then it's like, what, 10 minutes or something before you can turn it back on? No, yeah. no, no, God, no. But but running them that hot, it's Some hard on them, isn't it? Well, yeah, you can, you'll, you burn out trans, like, I, I did a study in the past on a thing called electro migraine, which is basically when your CPU is overused, like, Running a computer a CPU hot, you're gonna start burning out transistors, which is literally the literally the way the computer does the zero one binary code. It's either on or off. Yeah. And there's billions and billions of transistors in a CPU, and when they burn out, the the processor literally just marks it as a bad transistor and moves on to the next one. Well, after a long while, this is the reason why people who run their computers like five six years start saying, well, it's getting really slow even after a format. It doesn't feel fresh. The reason why is because that processor has been stressed out so much that over 50% of the transistors are shot. Now the computer can't produce the same amount of code or instructions <laughs> in the same cycle. <laughs> and we actually proved this at the university that electro migraine is a valid is a valid thing and it exists. Oh hell! So that's why people who overclock their computers they tend to notice quicker. Like if they overclock without proper cooling. 
they'll notice yeah. quicker that they're burning their shit out and the processor starts losing performance a lot quicker than someone who runs stock settings with a stock cooler. Thing goes for motherboards too. Yes. It's easier to fry the board than well. What used to be the north and south bridges. Yeah, now they're a combined bridge. Now they're just a DMA bus. I had that happen playing. Hi, buddy. Water. Oh, I cooked. I had the North Bridge blow on my old Asus board, on the old uh, yeah. AMD FX60. That was the weak point of that computer. Was that that uh, board? The rest of it was pretty rock solid. Ow. Have you looked at any of the Asus video cards there, Adam? Yeah, they're pretty nice. I get an Asus video card. I like the way they're built. I love it. Asus always had the best cooling technology when it came to any of the video cards. Yeah. Well, despite aftermarket, I'm talking stock here. You know, if you go liquid cooled, obviously it's going to beat anything stock from Asus. But e Asus's heat pipe technology is quite possibly the best thing ever made. But just, just your video card is liquid cooled, or what? No, my processor. Ah. Uh -huh. It's a lot of money to water cool uh, GPU. Yeah, you're looking at about 200 bucks for a cheap kit. Sometimes those can fail. Because I, I looked one up. Cooled. Well, your GPU did, not your video card. Yeah. My buddy spent about, yeah. I think, like two grand doing a loop on his PC. Yeah, like if he was like cooling everything, the video card, the processor, and the North or the uh, DMA bus, then yeah, that would be about right. The radiator alone would be about the length of the case. Yeah. How's it going, Ace, for me? Uh, we're doing pretty good, buddy. We're doing yeah, some racing. This Rass. case has it where you can put a radiator in the whole top of it. Yeah, this case oh. has that option, too. This is actually the first computer I ever had where the power supply was on the bottom, not on the top. Oh. Yeah, I've seen that's a new thing. Yeah, I like it. Computer. I like it, but I don't because heat rises. Yeah. yeah. But also having the uh, the pro the process break the power supply right under uh, right on top of the CPU. That's also bad, right? Because then all the heat from the CPU that's not getting pushed away is getting pushed into in, into your your power supply. Yeah. Which in turn is going to cause it to prematurely cook. Yeah. Same time though, some of those power supplies have pretty good uh, fans on them. Yeah, like the one I has has uh, twin 120 in it. Oh, buddy. Sorry. Mine has a single 140 in it. Like it's got the 120 on the bottom, and it's got a 120 on the top, on the out the back. So it's oh, like it's sucking too... air in and then blasting it out. So it's like forced air awesomeness, I guess, if you will. Yeah, mine has five 120 millimeter fans in it. Here I was like. Uh, looking for fan screws and shit. I, I need to pay attention to packaging. Both fans came with the screws to screw them on. All I gotta do now is go out to the garage and cut some Molexes up and make myself my leads so nice. I can uh, hook up those fans and pump air at the top of it. Fucking Ouch. hell. My case still uses 80 millimeter fans. Oh, uh, I don't know how to pronounce your name. Enget. I know I said that wrong. It's probably the end's probably silent. But after we're done this playlist, we're probably gonna try some of that sumo uh, last team standing stuff. Yeah. Sumo. Sumo. I'm not in last place. I'm happy. So what is the purpose, or like, what is it to just flex your EP? And like some of those motherboards have two i7 slots on them. Oh, that's just if you're, like, for gaming, having two i7s is kind of nuts. But if you're into, like, video video production, for like, what Pixar does, for instance, like 3D rendering, AutoCAD, uh, any of those processor-intense applications, you want as many processors as you can have in your rig to get that job done. 